a Chinese marine surveillance plane conducting a routine patrol of Chinese territorial waters over the Diaoyu Islands. In response, Japan scrambled eight F-15 fighter jets and early warning aircraft in an attempt to intercept the plane. Although the incident appears to have passed off without any direct confrontation, it's put further strain on already volatile China-Japan relations. Since September this year, Japan's ships and aircrafts have entered China's territorial waters and airspace over the Diaoyu Islands many times. China has repeatedly demanded that Japan stop its illegal activities, but Japan has given no response. It is absolutely necessary that China's marine patrol plane can carry out patrols over the Diaoyu Islands to protect China's sovereignty. Hongli pointed out that the current difficulties in China-Japan relations are the result of Japan's illegal purchase of the Diaoyu Islands. It's called on the Japanese government to correct its mistakes in a spirit of sincerity and take action through dialogue and negotiation. The incident also comes as ceremonies mark the 75th anniversary of the Nanjing Massacre, when Japanese Imperial Army troops embarked on a massacre of the population in the then Chinese capital. Japan's actions are contrary to international laws. A patrol plane is a law enforcement aircraft, but they deployed fighter jets. And we can also see Japan making preparation for military confrontation near the Diaoyu Islands. You can tell by how soon Japan's fighters arrived. They're stepping up deployment of military forces in the area. According to Japan's national broadcaster NHK, the frequency of the deployment of fighter jets by the Japanese Air Self-Defense Force, which target Chinese aircraft, has been on a steady rise in recent years. Despite a drop early this year, the Noda administration's announcement of so-called plans to nationalize the Diaoyu Islands have prompted another surge in deployments.